delightful dolls here. Quickly before we start, I want to give a big thank you to everyone who helped me get to 80 subscribers on this channel. Thank you so much and I'm so happy that we're growing. So I'm going to show you today how to make these mini food bags that can actually open that are the perfect size for your doll. The things you'll need to make this craft are a real life size um, Ziploc bag or food bag and you don't want it too big because you want it to not waste as much plastic as possible, a hot glue gun, a ruler, and scissors. First, you want to grab your Ziploc bag and you can either measure out how big you want it to be. Mine were one, two and a half inches by one and a half, not including this top ceiling part. Or you could just do your own measurements. And if you've already made them before, you can just use um, that as a guideline. Also, I tried these scissors, but they weren't sharp enough. So I want make sure you want, use a very sharp pair of scissors. These are some fabric scissors that worked great. And that is what it should look like now. Now, if you did, if you cut yours, your first one on one of the sides, then one side should already be sealed if you know what I mean. And if not, that's fine too. And you're gonna use your hot glue gun and you're just going to put a little bit of glue and rub the nozzle, the end of the hot glue along the edge that you want to seal. And then when it's cooled down a little bit, run your fingers across to really seal it and repeat that on all of the sides. And then cut off the extra green part that is um, that you don't want. And now, as you can see, there's this little, um, if you haven't already glued them, you have to make sure that you glue these little sides. You don't need to, but it makes it look more realistic if you glue those top sides. And now you are done your plastic Ziploc bag. So it will open and close just like a normal Ziploc bag, but in miniature. I've also seen other people who use tape to seal the edges, but when I put it on, when I put tape on the clear Ziploc bag, I realized that when you put the tape on, it gives it more of like a foggy look. You can't really see 100% through it, like as if it would actually be on a normal one. So that's why I use hot glue. I also cut these little veggies out of craft foam and I just put those into a Ziploc bag to make some food for a doll. So these Ziploc bags are perfect for a doll. This is a doll's hand. As you can see, they make perfect little Ziploc bags. You can also use these bags to put something for you, like earrings that you wouldn't want to get mixed up or lost. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time. Bye.